Hello everyone, this video I will show you this smart power distribution box. But this time we will make a 3D dashboard for home assistant. Uh, this is very beautiful. And you can see this is I have used the iPad and also you can use the Android pad. Uh, and also you can see I can use this um, PC software. So you can create this house 3D as your house and uh, so that you can easily to control by the the PC or by the pad. You can see, uh, let's look at the functions. Uh, this is KC868 server. That have a CM4, Raspberry Pi 4 inside, so that you can install the Home Assistant. And this is really extensively module, so that that MOSFET output control this relay. And this I have integrated the A16 board, so that can extend uh, for totally 32 channel relay output so this is another 16 channel relay output and this we can use the 16 channel input and this 16 channel output okay let's look at this dashboard so you can see i can use this ipad this is my house and this is country panel this is menu you can see i can click so that i can click for all and for off uh, this is like the home kit so that I have installed the HomeKit plugin so that can use this dashboard the style as HomeKit so you can see when I turn on then the turn off uh, the link will be on and off and also you can see I can click this country by the loom you can see I can click this and you can see uh, this will be on uh, and I can country this garage and this will be on so when the state is on and off uh, the, the photo will have the different you can see here Size sensor, so you can see the relay is on and off. Uh, this country by this panel. Now you can see I can also country in my compute. I can just click off, 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 off. And here I have some sensor. Uh, this garbage down sensor and this sensor. So you can see I can use that one. I can try to on the A16 board input that I have used before the sensor. And you can see if I have shot for this, shot for this, you can see the car, beside the car, the sensor is triangled. Shot, not shot. And the shot, the sensor on the dashboard will be changed. And this, this is mailbox. You can see, if you have a mailbox, there are some mail in the box, you can see the state will be changed. And this is sensor. And here, you can see uh, this is sensor. And you can see here is a walk along sensor. And also I can use this uh, many sensors on different room I have installed the sensor. So you can use this triangle and see the sensor state on your home assistant dashboard. Okay, so you can see here sensor and the sensor and the sensor. So this can be continually on or also can monitor the sensor. And this you can see, I can click, click, click. So that you can see that will be on and off. So this is for really on and off countering all device. And here you can see the time, the date, and the weather forecasting. So you can see here, that is weather forecasting. And also you can see here is the temperature sensor. Because we have used this DS18B20 temperature sensor. And here you can click so that you can see the temperature history. Okay, and here you can see there are two icons. This I have created this icon and this is my wife. 
so that if you have installed the home assistant application mobile phone application so that you can see the state the state is at home or not at home so that will have a different color so this is a dashboard and this dashboard you can create at here and also we have prepared you can see here there are some plugin you need to install on HACS and here is some config file so you can see here I have installed the HACS for this beautiful plugin so click this front end and you can see some card I have installed so you just can install by this card list I have list this card list and also you can see the config file the config file you can just click the dashboard and click this three point and add a dashboard and you can see here we can see the config at and here is some config file that is for the dashboard so maybe you will see uh, it's difficult to use but it's easy not very difficult just every photo you will uh, use this uh, like this lamp uh, sometimes the talking and for on and for off color so you can see here we can also have the demos UI files so you can see here there are some many files this is the dashboard you can see uh, when the light is on and here you can see when the light is off so there are some different room we will have different photos just when the state is on and off and on and off and the sensor and the device on and off so you will see all oh, at here if you want to use by your house you can just replace these files with yourself and here you can see the menu this is the button the lights and the country room so that you can see here just the rooms and the lights and also you can see here is the person so that you can see the icon the at home or not at home or working so you will uh, set some different photos icons on your UI photo so you just need to prepare the photos and replace by yourself by the home assistant so you will see uh, this will be easy to use this 3D dashboard okay thanks for watching